What's up, guys? It's Camacho again, and I have a very, very special coin that I want to talk about today. I've been watching this one for a long time. I've been holding this one for a long time. I knew this one had significant potential many years back, and it just has blown my mind, the growth, the progress we've seen with this particular coin, and it is amazing what it's about to do. I'm talking about the world's premier decentralized compute marketplace, all right? What, what does that mean, all right? Everybody knows what AWS is or Amazon Web Services, right? Where you can go buy and sell and use or utilize different cloud infrastructure resources or computing infrastructure resources hosted by Amazon, right? Amazon has a massive e-commerce um, and, and other kind of businesses, right? And they need a way to scale their business. So they've built this massive, massive um, IT infrastructure to offer compute resources, to offer re memory management, to offer hosting services, to offer all different types of kind of enterprise IT network um, infra infrastructure services kind of as a, as a platform, as a service to the world, right? Now, what if there was a coin that could do the same thing that was built on blockchain and had public utility, right? That is what I am talking about today. What coin am I talking about? I am talking about Akash Network, right? Or AKT. It's still very early on in its journey. The prices we've seen have gone significantly up, but there is so much more room for this one to go to the moon. And this one is definitely not a scam coin. I could confidently say that. This one, the, the founder, the team has been building for many years, you know, similar to like an AGIX, but this is AKT, Akash Network. But they've been building for years and they're starting to gain significant, significant momentum. All right. I'm talking about the world's first decentralized compute marketplace, Akash Network. Akash is an open network that lets users buy and sell computing resources securely and efficiently for purpose built for public utility, right? So think of like a decentralized Amazon Web Services or a decentralized AWS that you can actually buy, use, utilize services and resources using a native cryptocurrency token, which in this case is AKT, right? Like I said, they made a ton of tremendous headway. I wanna jump into the chart because I wanna show you kind of what this looks like before really jumping in to the website itself and what they actually do and are capable of. So let's jump right into the Akash Network or AKT chart, all right? So look at here, this is incredible. It's building a huge cup and handle formation right now, right? So back in 2021, this is Gate.io. Back in 2021, this coin was listed on Gate.io on kind of in March 2021. And we've seen it go, you know, as high as about $9, approximately nine, about $8.50, $9. And then we've seen it go down now as low as 21 cents. Incredible, right? Only in crypto, only in cryptocurrency can you see those prices. I knew I should have bought a lot more at 21 cents during this massive bear market, but I didn't. But I've held on to much of my AKT for, for many years, for, for a very long time. And now you can see this massive cup and handle formation forming. We've gone all the way back in recent uh, recent uh, weeks um, to $6.50, okay? All the way from 20 cents. So what, what is that? that? That was an increase of over 2,000, about 2,400%. And now we're seeing a slight downturn, right? Because again, it's been a downturn in the overall crypto market. And it's ironic because you're seeing now a cup and handle form. You know, and so you could potentially get into this in the next couple of weeks, couple of months at a much lower price if there is an actual downturn in the bear market. But I think this is going to go much higher than than eight dollars and nine dollars. I think this is going up into the the kind of tens or hundreds at some point, right? If they can continue to scale their their uh, their persona, continue to partner, so forth and so on. I think this one has a ton of potential. So let's go look a little bit more at Akash, right? So Akash has 100,000, 111,000 followers on Twitter. Not a bad start. They actually just announced on March 18th that they're going to begin trading on Coinbase, right? Very nice, very bullish that they're going to be trading on Coinbase, the world's largest, one of the world's largest cryptocurrency exchanges. They're going to be you know, trading on that now. They're starting to integrate with different decentralized AI uh, capabilities and services. Another bullish, bullish sign. They're going to be you know, leveraging the AI kind of um, the AI interest, let's say, and allowing people to build on the Akash network with these different AI capabilities. Again, another very bullish sign. Um, and they just keep growing, right? They're having these massive events, which you can see right here. 
and the price and everything else is following along with it. So now let's look into the tech just a little bit more, right? So as I mentioned, it's the world's uh, premier decentralized compute marketplace, allows people to you know, buy and sell resources for computing purposes on a public utilities scale. Um, and and you can know you can view the the pricing to use their GPUs. You can provide uh, become a provider and provide compute and actually earn uh, uh, Kosh tokens if you provide computing power to the network. Um, you can deploy with Kosh on a console, and so get started with the network's user friendly deployment console. Right, so you could deploy different resources, different services with their actual console. Console. A lot of things behind this, guys. I'm not going to be able to get into it all in this video, but you can see the power of this itself. Right. Key features of the Akash SuperCloud, infrastructure as code. Akash's orchestration layer fueled by SDL enables intricate deployments across regions, providers with resource control and price decisions. Kubernetes powered, built on Kubernetes. Um, Akash ensured a secure, tested, and reliable platform similar to an AWS, right? It's very secure, very reliable. Persistent storage. Akash offers limitless storage, safeguarding data, even post restart, an ideal feature for data intensive apps. So they're promising limitless storage that will not go down, right? And remember, this is on the blockchain. So um, it's a little different than AWS. Dedicated IP listing, uh, leasing. By leasing a dedicated IP address, Akash permits port assignment, directing traffic, especially beneficial for DNS, web servers, and so forth. So you can actually host your different websites and web servers on this protocol. And you can, you can actually then use some of that uh, computing resource to earn AKT tokens, right? We're pretty cool, right? Permissionless. Akash democratizes secure censorship resistance, app development, deployment, open to all innovators. So the world is going permissionless. It's going permissionless with these different blockchain capabilities that are coming out. Now, remember, Amazon is a centralized company. AWS is a centralized company. When they make money, Amazon makes money, right? In this case, when AKT goes up in value and in um, compete you know, power, let's say, the price of AKT goes up. The, the token price goes up. The ability to earn more of those tokens goes up, right? So it's like power back to the people because you're going to be getting these tokens rather than all of this money going back into a centralized company like Amazon, right? So lastly, peer-to-peer -peer and private, peer-to-peer -peer communication guarantees data privacy, payment transparency, and immunity from central control, reinforcing dependability. So again, a decentralized Amazon web services. How, how crazy is that? How cool is that? Unbelievable. A decentralized Amazon web services that can scale, that can pay you in AKT tokens, that can pay you in cryptocurrency. Like this one has got some massive, massive potential. Wish you would have gotten earlier. Wish I would have made a video about this earlier for you guys. But let's keep going on a little bit more on the on the on the website. Create your own sovereign com, uh, compute experience with the super cloud. So it's a super cloud, right? This is not just a cloud because a cloud is usually owned by a company, aka Amazon. This is a super cloud where it's in the blockchain. It's in the sky. It's it's a it's a secured cloud um, with without a centralized control behind it because it's completely decentralized, right? Very very cool. Seamlessly scale and access a global array of services while keeping control of your budget with the Akash reverse auction system. Enjoy prices up to 85% lower than other public clouds. So this is 85% lower than potentially than an Amazon or a Google or a Microsoft of Azure, right? Quick little drink break there. Sorry about that. Pioneering layer one protocol built on Cosmos. So it's built on the Cosmos network, secured by a native token, AKT. It's the first blockchain to achieve IBC communication with Cosmos Hub, enabling seamless connections to other IBC compatible blockchains. So it's becoming interchangeable with other blockchains, not fully there yet, but, be, but getting there. The, the Akash protocol prioritizes user privacy and security, allowing for anonymous deployment of applications. So again, it's anonymous, right? So you could, you could deploy applications on Amazon, not anonymously. They know who you are. They know your bank information. They know whatever, right? They can turn you off at any time. Akash can't, and they don't, right? Because they're decentralized and anonymous. So what is possible with Akash? Akash is a community owned and managed. As a free public service, its source code is available to anyone, everyone. The community actively oversees all aspects of Akash, making decisions about the implementation of new features. So this is not like an AWS that can be turned off. It's way, way more sophisticated than that. And if I were Amazon, I'd be looking at this because you know they're not going to compete with Amazon anytime like in the near future. But in the long run, it may give Amazon a run for their money, AWS a run for their money. But I think we're still a ways off from that. Um, but, you know, the world's becoming decentralized. The world is becoming much, much more, you know, um, you know, I, I, as I mentioned years ago, 
everything that's built on web 2.0 and that was centralized will be rebuilt on web three and will become decentralized. Let me, let me say that again, everything that was built on web 2.0 that was centralized will now be rebuilt on web three and become decentralized. And if there's utility behind that, as there is with the cosh network, you're going to see a massive increase in the price over time, right? It's not going to happen instantaneously, but the more and more of these services are used, the more and more of these tokens are going to go up in value because they're the one, they're the, they're the thing, the currency facilitating these transactions on a public ledger on blockchain, right? Think about that for a minute. Think about that. That's incredibly powerful to know. Okay. So again, I want to go back. I want to show you, dive a little bit more into this. I'm not going to stay too long on this site, but it's worth noting a few more things. Okay. About Akash, Akash stats. Let's jump into Akash stats real quick. Um, I think that's a very interesting one. Okay. Network summary. You know, you could check out all these stats, right? All the network uh, stats, the amount of money spent. It's peanuts right now compared to. AWS, the number of leases, 164,000, um, the, the amount of compute, 4.79 thousand CPU increase. And these numbers, you can go dig deeper into them. You should watch these. These are going to go up. As these go up on the Akash Network mainnet, you're going to see the price go up as well. And over time, these are slowly going up, right? And it'll it'll give you all the information about this. You know, I'm not going to, like I said, I'm not going to jump too far into that, but you get what I'm saying, okay? Then the ecosystem, dive into the Akash ecosystem. And, you know, so forth and so on. So Kosh has the potential, guys, has the potential to go to the moon. It's already risen pretty significantly, but I think it has tremendous potential to continue to go up. And, uh, you know, I would check this coin out if you haven't already. Um, I love it and I'm going to continue to watch it. So this is Dan, Crypto Camacho. Hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think about AKT, about Akash Network to the moon. See ya.